This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to set up your RC as well as your game. Now first off, your RC, you want to make sure your receiver type is set at traditional. You want to make sure your receiver advanced protection is set to on. Now, you want to turn your radio on. Now, first you're going to click start on here. You want to make sure that before this, you want to make sure that all the sticks, if you bring them all to the bottom left, that everything goes to the left side. So as you can see, everything's going to the left side. So that's great. If for any reason it's going to the opposite side, make sure you just reverse it by clicking the tabs on the side. It will say reverse or normal. Um, so you can make the adjustments there. Uh, when you're ready, click start. And you're going to do is you're going to bring all four sticks to every single corner and let go. Once you let go, you click finish. It's basically calibrating the endpoints on your radio. So we set that. And now you want to make sure that your switch, which we set as flap gyro, is controlling the U switch. If for any reason it is not controlling the U switch, what you want to do is you want to turn off your radio, you want to hold down your roller, and you want to turn it on so you can access your system menu in the DX8. So as you can see, if you scroll down, you'll see switch select. So you click switch select and it's going to give you um, the switch select. So you want to make sure everything is trainer is inhibited, F mode is inhibited, gear is set to gear, L trim is inhibited, flap is set to AUX1, mix is inhibited, AUX2 is AUX2, R trim is inhibited, knob is AUX3. And um, the reason for the gear switch is so that the gear is actually set um, on the switches up here. Uh, now for the gear switch, it's actually set on the two position currently on this. What we want to do is we actually want to move it to the F mode. So we're going to scroll down and click the gear and we're going to inhibit this and scroll up to F mode and set that to gear. This way our IOC, which we will go over further in the later video tutorials, um, will be set onto F mode switch at the top right here. So when we have that set, um, we're going to scroll up to list, scroll all the way to the left again, and you're going to access the main screen. So you're going to click and it's going to go into the regular uh, screen for the DX8. So as you can see, everything GPS, it's flipped up, down, and if you see X2, this is going to be the IOC, which we will go further detail in later. Um, on the future videos, so if you flip the F mode switch, you can see that the tab on the X2 is also adjusting. Now, the next thing we're going to go over is gains. Now, gains for the basic gains on the matrix, we have a default setting of 130% for the pitch, 120% for the roll, 90% for the yaw. 130% for vertical, 100% for attitude gain, and 100% for the roll gain. Now, if for any reason you make any adjustments, you'll see right here, we, we have one It's highlighted in red. If you want to save it, you click enter. If you don't want to save it, um, you don't click enter. So, um, again, our default is this setting. So it's a 130, 120, 90, 130, 100, 100. And this is how to set up your basic RC as well as your basic gain for the matrix on the NASA MV2.